I'm Nikki Bush and this afternoon I'm sitting here with Elon Reyes, founder of Reyes Corp, one of the biggest business incubators or the biggest business incubator in Africa. Elon, you and I have been fiddling around with writing a book for parents for quite some time now and uh, you're actually taking things a step further by, by launching an entrepreneurship gap year. But before we talk about that, I just really want to talk about um, entrepreneurship on the whole when it comes to young people. Mm. Um, and, and you guys have had a lot of experience of launching businesses around Africa. How many businesses have you launched in how many years? So this is our 17th year. We're, uh, we're reaching 10,500 businesses that we've worked with over the, over the 17 years. Currently, we have 500 businesses that we support right now. Wow. And that's uh, the biggest one being 750 million US dollars revenue and the smallest one being a couple of thousand rand a month. Oh, yeah. Wow. So, you know, we talk about, um, you and I have had conversations often about how many matriculants are not going to get a job. And that's quite a high statistic at the mm. moment. Mm. About the, 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 the stats show around 50% of kids uh, that are graduating from school will not find a, a job. Um, and that's a function of uh, how the, the job market is changing and of course our skills requirements which are uh, very different to what education is providing and uh, that's a problem if you're a, a politician or a parent <laughs> both you know politician and parents are a, and a young person it's a, it's a problem because you can't you have to get the opportunity to get into the market in order to gain the experience um, yeah, because without experience you're not worth much and so we talk about the fact that in the future small and medium-sized businesses are probably going to be the biggest employers Mm. Um, but if that's the case, we need more and more people starting up businesses, but it's not quite as easy as just going out there and starting a business, is it? Yeah, so if you look at the, the stats, around 65, 66% of all new employment actually comes from the SME market. I hate the term SME, but the small business market, they're, they're actually the employers. So it is a big um, part of the solution is to get more small businesses up to become medium and, and large businesses. Um, but the, the issue is that there is a very high failure rate um, amongst entrepreneurs. 96% of businesses will fail within the 10 year period. And what you find is that what I'm finding now is the, the, the because uh, the, the young people are finding it harder and harder to find work, more and more of them are turning to entrepreneurship, self-employment as, as a solution. And because they haven't had the exposure to entrepreneurship skills, business skills, even the simple things like how an income statement works, they go into business and they make um, quite rookie mistakes, which if they just had that, that information, um, that they would have um, most likely have succeeded. Okay, so you run award-winning training programs for entrepreneurs anyway. Yes. And you've now extended that into the youth market. Yes. Uh, your entrepreneurship gap year that you launched for 2017, who's it suitable for? So this is suitable for post-matric and post-graduates, people who've just uh, left the trick recently and are, are deciding whether or not they are going to be an entrepreneur. And many young people know instinctively in their, in their heart that they're entrepreneurial and they're just waiting for the moment. So it's, got, it's aimed at those people, it's aimed at people who, who are are thinking about entrepreneurship but want it quite a safe environment to experiment in and so we provide that that safe environment and for postgraduates who are wanting to take their knowledge and f and and give it a, a real life experience so that when they launch their businesses they've had the they've had the theory and now they've got the, the some of the practical and that the combination will give them a much higher probability of success. So taking theory and putting it into practice um, is just so important, otherwise it's, it's just textbook knowledge. Mm. Um, but you also said something to me the other day about uh, this is not the year about finding yourself, mm. but about creating yourself. And I yeah. really thought that was, that was a great way of looking at this. Because yeah. I think there's a, there's a, looking at your course framework, there's a lot of opportunity for self-discovery mm. but also um, it's experiential and very interactive and uh, we always talk about the law of unintended consequences mm. so yeah so the, the, you know this gap year is a uh, I mean in my, maybe I've got too much gray hair but uh, we didn't have gap years in my day <laughs> then it became quite fashionable and and with the rand dollar where it is with the, the tertiary education uh, where it is 
um, you know, there's, there's um, for people who are wanting to go out there, the, the impetus was um, a lot of people, this is where it started, uh, ironically we're talking about the unintended consequence, was people started saying, well, I want to go and discover myself. And there were some people who were saying, well, I don't, I want to create myself. How do I create myself? And this is an internal locus of control. So coming back to even your previous question about who's, the, who's this for, this is for people who have a high internal lo locus of control or who want to determine their own future. Who are driven. Driven. And prepared to continue being drivers because being an entrepreneur, you never get off the horse. <laughs> it's no. an exhausting, it's an yeah. exhausting business. Yeah. So, um, so really, I, I guess what we're saying to parents out there is, if you've still got a, a youngster in your home who either doesn't know what to do, what to do, um, is looking for some fresh inspiration, if you're wanting uh, your child to learn how to problem solve for profit, mm. then uh, the entrepreneurship gap year could be for you. Mm. And uh, where can people find more information about this? Because I think you've still got a few spaces left for 2017. Yeah, we've decided to keep this year very, very uh, um, small so that we can give a lot of focus and ensure that we have big success. So. You can go to www.entrepreneurshipgapyear.co.za uh, entrepreneurship <laughs> and you can apply online there uh, and there's also a phone number to, to call on there. Yeah, if you want some more information. Yeah. I think it's a fabulous initiative. I really wish you amazing luck with it. I think anybody who goes through this is going to have such a fabulous start. So can I talk about um, the, the, when it starts and ends? Yes, absolutely. So, so it starts in Feb the, this year. It ends in, in uh, November this year. So it's 10 months. It's 10 months. Yeah. It's incredibly practical. So the, the days are constructed where there's a, a, on, on one day there's all the practical learning. So there's classroom learning. They work with entrepreneurs. They're exposed to entrepreneurs, live entrepreneurs. So you build a, a network. You get an in to the network, which is invaluable. That to me, you know, we would never guarantee it, but us can, yeah, I don't want to mention names of the people who have shown interest to get involved with okay. the, the, the individuals who come on this program, but these are big names, South African entrepreneurs who are interested in this, so that, that network is created. Then there's the ability to build a business case of what we call a business think. We also teach the, 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 the people, the, the kids on the, on the program how to pitch how to pitch to an investor, how to pitch to a, a sales pitch, and they do it again and again, all these simulations. And finally, I think what's also very important is that we teach them how to think differently. There's thinking skills uh, on how to solve problems in an entrepreneurial way. And, and more than anything, is coming up with ideas and finding the gap in the market, because that's what computers can't do. Opportunity <laughs> eyes, we teach them opportunity eyes. Fantastic. Well, Alon, thank you so much for your time. And um, you know where to get the information. Can we have that website address again? www.entrepreneurshipgapyear.co.za Thanks, Alon. Thank you.